Biotech pellet boilers have a system called DCC, dual combustion control. This is a patented way of controlling both the amount of fuel and the amount of air that is introduced into the combustion chamber at any one time, through a feedback loop within the boiler that is looking at the output from the lambda sensor and two air sensors, primary and secondary. The air sensors will need to be cleaned and inspected during an annual service. The location of the air sensors in a biotech boiler is in the lower section of the boiler on the right hand side. The lower sensor is the primary air, the upper sensor is the secondary air. The air sensors work by measuring the flow rate of the air coming past the sensor into the boiler. Over time the air sensors will get dusty, which will affect their ability to read correctly. During an annual service you therefore need to clean these. Firstly, turn off the boiler at the screen. Then turn off the power at the wall. It is important that safe isolation occurs before working with the air sensors, otherwise it is possible that you will damage a sensor by short-circuiting it. Cut the retaining cable tie and firmly pull the sensor out. It is best just to remove and clean one sensor at a time, so that you do not mix them up. With the sensor removed, use a fine bristled brush to gently remove any dust. Then replace the sensor and secure with a new cable tie. When reinstalling, consider the direction that you are plugging in the sensor. They must face the external side of the boiler. When checking the air mass sensors and the tube assembly, you need to ensure 100% leak tightness. Before restarting the boiler, it is always a good idea to test both the primary and secondary air sensors in aggregate test mode on your boiler. Mm -hmm.